morning children in the first session we saw how to solve the revision worksheet now in the second period we are going to see our next term book 2 correct it's second number book because you all have come in standard 2 term 1 book a is first term book which is in blue color now you all have already learned in standard 1 there are three sections first yellow then white and then again yellow this section is a math section this is a english section and this is evs section i want you all to open the textbook to page number 3 and today we are going to learn lesson number 1 shapes lines and shadows but before that let me do a activity in this activity i'll come to know how many shapes you all know how many shapes you have learned in standard 1 okay now here is the activity i'm going to show you some shapes and you're going to identify it which is this shape two it is a circle which is the shape yes it's a oval and oval shape which is this shape yes it's a cone which is this shape correct this is a cube and this yes it's a cuboid which is this shape rectangle correct my you all are guessing all the shapes right and this shape yeah it's a cylinder now we also have a gas cylinder in our house in the kitchen so that is also cylinder shape i am very happy and i give a round of applause for you all for identifying the shapes now let's go to lesson number 1 shapes lines and shadows i want you all to take a pencil in your hand this pencil will be our pointer yes lesson number 1 shapes lines and shadows let's go to jump start jump start means the things which you already have learned in standard 1 let's go to question 1 how many corners does each shape in the given image have square let's see 1 2 3 4 so i want you to take your pencil and write in this box four corners a triangle has how many corners 1 2 3 i want you all to take your pencil and write your 3 a circle has mm, no corners so we'll write your 0 a rectangle has let's check out 1 2 3 4 four corners so i want you all to complete these boxes done let's go to question number 2 name the shapes tick the ones that slide and cross the ones that roll you have learned in standard 1 the things which slant and the things which slide and the things which roll okay so this cube is going to correct it is going to slide so we are going to put a tick mark 
Hmm, the ball is going to, correct, it's going to roll. So we are going to put a cross sign. Yes, cuboid is going to slide, correct. So put a tick mark. You all have done this activity on the slides in our school. I have seen you. Good job. Now, these are the boxes where the questions are which you know already. That means I can. It means you all know these things. So, you all know the names of solid shapes and you can name solid shapes. Correct. So, put a tick mark here. You can identify objects that roll or slide. Correct. Put a tick mark. You can name the different flat shapes that is square, rectangle, circle and triangle. Put a tick mark. Find the numbers of corners of a flat shape. Yes, just now we did. Put a tick mark. And identify the curved and straight lines. Yes, you have learned this. Put a tick mark. Turn the page. Children, these are the things which you are going to learn in this topic. And these are the key terms. Now, flat face, curved face, shadow, stress, diagonal, straight line, horizontal line, vertical line and slanting line. So, these all key terms we are going to learn. But let us start with the first topic that is celebrating Christmas. Oh, we all love celebrating Christmas, isn't it? It is Christmas time. Serena wants to decorate her Christmas tree. Spot some shapes in the this picture. How many did you spot? Now, please observe the picture which is in your textbook. There are cuboids, there are cubes, there are cones, cylinders. Identify the objects, identify their color, see in which color, which shape is. Yes. Now let's go to page number 5. Now we are going to identify the solid shapes. This is how the Christmas tree looks. Can you write the names of the shapes on the Christmas tree? Wow, see this beautiful tree. Yes, you all can identify, I know. Now let's see. See the color of this box. It's a purple color. It's a cube. So write the spelling in this on this line. C U B E Q. Which is this shape? Correct. It's a Circle. C I R C L E. Circle. This is cone. C O N E. Cone. Cuboid. C U B O I D. Cuboid. And cylinder. C Y L I N D E R. Cylinder. Now, when the shape will be in this way, we are going to call it as sphere. Yes? Look at this question and read. Now, look at these objects. Tick the ones that have flat faces and cross the ones that have curved faces. Now, always remember children, this is our remember chit, a uh, owl who tells you to remember these things. The surface of a solid object is called its face. That means the surface of the object is called its face. Okay, now we are going to, we are going to tick the ones that is flat face and the ones that is curved face, we are going to put a cross sign. This is curved, this is flat and this is also flat. Identify the types of faces the 
this gift item has. Okay. Now look at another decorative item. It is in the shape of a cylinder. It has a curved surface as well as a flat surface. Curved face, curved surface and a flat surface. Very good.